people guys welcome back to another video whatever you are special greetings to you and don't forget if today is your first time please do me a favor by subscribing to the channel also don't forget to hit on the notification bell whenever you draw video you can also get it and watch and don't forget this channel is all about education entertainment and document so if you want to subscribe or if you want to join the family you can subscribe and automatically you are part of this amazing family today we are here once again with another episode we are going to talk about luigi di mayo and luciana lamorgese going to to tunisia to sign an agreement with the president of tunisia and we are also going to look at the return or the deportation that they have done some immigrants so guys without wasting my time let's do this thing together <laughs> You guys, as we all know, the way Italians are blaming this interior minister, Luciana Lamorgese, that she is the one that allows uh, immigrants to enter because within this year they have rescued like 15,000 immigrants and there are still some immigrants on top of the sea, you understand, and then they are ready to bring them on dry land and they are also still deporting some people you understand they are still returning some people if they come they still return them you understand because there are a lot of people here and then salvini is against this in every day every day whenever salvini do interview he she, he is going to talk about this thing that is the woman that allows a uh, immigrant to come and uh, you know these days even yesterday immigrant arrived you understand because of this month is very i think the weather is good so people are trying to enter and then nowadays they pass uh, tunisia you understand they give them a small boat with a little number of people to just come you understand it's not like they will do it big so sometimes they come these people also rescue them you understand so they they said Lamborghese or that interior minister has uh, rescued a lot of immigrants. The immigrants they have rescued, they are too much and some are coming with coronavirus. So uh, Luciana Lamborghese should try and then break this thing, you understand? And then this woman is trying her best. And then uh, Luigi Di Maio, the, the minister for foreign affairs, the minister for foreign affairs, that is Lucia, uh, Luigi Di Maio, the minister for foreign affairs, said Luciana Lamborghese, you know what we have to do now we have to just go to tunisia so that we will sign agreement with tunisia and then some uh, leaders or some people from the european union you understand so luigi di Maio and then luciana lamorgese went to tunisia and then they signed this agreement with the tunisian president so that they can help them uh, reduce this uh, illegal immigrant you understand because if you do not pass through air uh, and then you do not come with visa if you pass through this sea they call you illegal immigrant you understand so they should stop uh, they should help them stop this illegal immigrant you understand so so guys let's watch the first video of luciana lamorgese and luigi di Maio when they were going to tunisia and then some of the returns they do some immigrant Missione Tunisi per la ministra dell'interno Luciana Lamorgese e il ministro degli esteri Luigi Di Maio. Una trasferta nella capitale nordafricana per mettere un freno alle partenze di migranti e sollecitare il meccanismo dei rimpatri. Quella dalla Tunisia rappresenta la nuova rotta del flusso migratorio. Dall'inizio dell'anno su 15.000 persone arrivate via mare sulle nostre coste Quasi la metà, 6.500, sono di nazionalità tunisina. Sono i cosiddetti sbarchi in autonomia che hanno praticamente raggiunto la quota delle partenze dalla Libia. Giovani che fuggono da un paese in crisi con il Covid che ha spento il turismo e il governo che dopo le elezioni ancora manca. Dalle coste di Sfax a bordo di gommoni o barchette arrivano in poche ore a Lampedusa e sono in Europa. Queste sono le ultime immagini. In due giorni, tra sabato e domenica, sono arrivati sull'isola più di 700 migranti, prevalentemente dalla Tunisia. Questa notte altri arrivi. È così tutti i giorni un flusso che non si ferma, con l'hotspot pieno e l'ira del sindaco che chiede lo stato di emergenza. A Tunisi è previsto un incontro con il Presidente della Repubblica, Kais Sayed, il Premier incaricato. Ad accompagnare la delegazione italiana ci sono due commissari europei, due rappresentanti di Bruxelles che la Ministra Lamorgese ha incontrato alla partenza all'aeroporto di Ciampino. 
presenza significativa quella dei due commissari europei, sottolinea il Viminale, dopo che l'Italia ha sollecitato un intervento diretto della UE nella trattativa attiva con la Tunisia. La Morgese è già stata a Tunisi meno di un mese fa. Dopo quella visita il governo tunisino ha rafforzato la sorveglianza sulle spiagge e il pattugliamento marittimo nella zona di Sfax. Sono stati arrestati scafisti ma le partenze non si sono fermate. L'accordo sui rimpatri sospeso per mesi a causa del coronavirus è stato riattivato da pochi giorni ma il numero di 80 persone a settimana con voli charter secondo il Viminale è insufficiente. Per questo i ministri solleciteranno un aumento dei rimpatri e una velocizzazione delle procedure burocratiche. I hope you have seen the video, so that is that for you. Luciana Lamorgese is trying her best, you understand, because she said she cannot leave uh, people on top of the sea, you understand, because Salvini uh, tried to do that and then now he will have to go and face the court, you understand. So this woman is saying, no, we will rescue you and then we will see what we can do to you later, because you cannot tell the people to stand on the sea, you understand, you need to rescue them for the first place and then anything or any step that you have to take you can take it over there you understand so we are going to look at the other one where they were speaking you know they went to tunisia and then tunisia they have to speak uh, italian luciana lamorgese need to speak italian so that the translator will also translate it in arab you understand so whatever uh, luciana lamorgese was saying that she said she want to thank them for uh, what they have done you understand they have done a lot but still you know there are some people even if you are trying to close the borders they will try to do some illegal uh, pushing you understand so she is thanking them for what they have done and she is still telling them to help the uh, italian to i mean stop this illegal migrant you understand if not they cannot do it alone you understand so so far as they are passing through now they have seen that immigrants are passing through uh, uh tunisia so, so far as they have seen that now immigrants are passing through tunisia so they want to tell tunisian people to help them so that they can do what they cannot try to i mean block the this crisis of immigrant and then they can also be safe you understand so guys let's go and watch that other video when we are back we will give you the remaining update Il 
per affrontare il problema del fatto dell'immigrazione sul nostro territorio e sulle risposte più vicine è un problema che va affrontato a livello europeo e la loro presenza qui è la dimostrazione di come venga seguito attentamente ai massimi livelli la situazione della Tunisia e la cooperazione con i paesi europei. Noi siamo pronti come Italia, come governo, come ministro dell'interno a prendere tutte le iniziative necessarie per supportare la Tunisia in termini di mezzi, di strumentazioni. Infine nel controllo dell'immigrazione clandestina. Siamo sicura che insieme lavoreremo anche attraverso dei progetti europei che possono riguardare i giovani che non devono vedere l'Italia come un punto d'approdo. perché il loro futuro può essere qui in Tunisia, una terra bellissima che ha bisogno solo del nostro aiuto. Grazie. Yeah, I hope you guys have seen the video. So that is that for you live from Tunisia with uh, Luciana Lamoregese, who is the Interior Minister and then the Minister for Foreign Affairs, which is Luigi Di Maio. That is the update from the immigration side of Italy. So guys, let me just summarize everything or let's just summarize everything in three and I think we can wrap up. Okay, I will see you for Babiam will be on chess or on coin. I will be on chess or on coin. I will subscribe to a YouTube channel. No, no, I click on the uh, notification bell no so and i say a dumb man so a bread video but to be also on sabay day back now when you're here and they have the title brand with luciana lamore jesu on a luigi di mayo a tunisia acquired a omni tunisia for a cocasa a omopes a tunisia for a boa mono mutimi a day a break is a immigration system because tunisia and i say a man for the donor a day a fa and i see no so the donor so by a sorry ten on my back what you say you're more a tenny and i say the donor more so much more virus no you're only part do a uma rescue ou moa a moa um suono só a moa só a moa eu a moa testa é só a moa corona na só a moa corona o que é assim é na a moa só a moa é só o meu time aí de a stop é na a mãe foi só a ser médica a cano o mais a ser só aí de é de ter né a mãe foi porque o meu mano é só no um time em já imigrante um suono só porque só de salvini é já de se salvini é o que o físico é todo o só no um time em já imigrante um suono só só ba o meu eu na a felita no o mano de o meu só o meu bar de ter na só o meu eu de um ano de é o amor o que é assim tino o mano é líderes menino a o meu filho europeu vinha no mu é na coisa essa meeting no é o a friend is saying Tunisia. Tino na update I want so guys. That is that for you. They have they went to Tunisia to break the trafficking, the trafficking of the immigration system. So that is that I have for you today. So guys, till we meet again in the next video. Stay safe and stay blessed. Bye bye.